okay to have everyone in harmony, regardless of races. Speaking of racial harmony, I have to tell you more about Singapore. First, I'll play the shorter version of the Singapore National Anthem. Focus on the stage, which is about racial harmony. Is it because Malay was the first language used in Singapore? I thought it's because Malay is our national language. You are both correct. This is because of history. Singapore used to be a Malay fishing shop at the tip of the Malay Army Palace. But in the 19th century, it was colonized by the English men, Serbs, and Hitler. From that point on, Singapore has been developing economically, financially, politically into the modern day the metropolis we know today and think of. Even today, we are progressing in the uh, in various fields, striving to the world leaders. Uh, can you give more examples of how Singapore is becoming more awesome by the way? And that is just the tip of the iceberg. Other attractions include Singapore Botanic Islands. What? It's the Durham Bird Park. The National Museum. Well, uh, the Magnucci Nature Trail and the Singapore Nature Reserve. Very good class. I think we all done a good job describing Singapore's attractions. However, the most important thing is not our tourism nor economic. What is most outstanding about Singapore culture is the multiracial uh, nature of our culture. Ever since the 1800s, there has been a huge influx of immigrants from all over the world, which is due to Singapore's rising popularity among the children back then. As of now, Singapore is made up of a diverse populace of 5 million people. Uh, of Chinese, Malay, Indian, and Eurasian descent, as well as other big Asian minorities. Uh, what testament of this is found in our food? Can anyone give any examples? Ah, so according to Chinese in our society, we have many Chinese food, such as the Hainanese chicken rice, wonton noodles, dumplings, and much more. Oh, and we also have Indian food like curry fish with roti prata, as well as spirit tarik. And we also have a variety of Malay cuisine, such as satay and beef and lard. Yes indeed, Singapore is a melting pot of the Chinese, British, Malay and Indian cultures. It is also a reflection of our immigration, uh, our immigrant history. To end this off, we shall sing our 1990 National Day Parade song. One people, one nation, one Singapore. <laughs> 